Welcome back folks, you join us at a very tense moment. We're about to take on Ultimecia. I've got to apologise for the last few videos in which we lost in-game sound. I'm still not sure what happened, but I saved over the point where I could go back and redo the whole thing. Thankfully, I saved just before this battle. What we've done is... We've got quite a lot of good stuff, but... You know, we're not going to be using it really. What we did do, by using I, uh, the tool ability, we got lots of Phoenix Pinions, just in case. This is it, folks. This is the final, final battle of Final Fantasy VIII. We've come a long way. Let's complete it together. Amicia, scourge of time. It ends here for you. That makes me feel pretty cool. It shows that we've been fighting it for years. And we're going to stop time compression. You're not going to get away with this, Ultimecia. No, we won't, because we're going to stop you here and now. Welcome to the final battle of Final Fantasy VIII. This battle can be annoying to start off with, as she actually summons three random party members. See, we got crappy Irvine, so let's kill him off. That's exactly what we wanted. That won't do any damage, because we absorb it. Where's Triple? Where's Triple? There it is. Let's speed selfie up a bit. <coughs> now I'm just going to wait until Irvine disappears, like that. Each time a part member dies, something takes him away, just like that. Hopefully we'll get Zell next. No, Quistis. Oh shit, I attacked the wrong person then. Fun dagger, useless, it'll heal us. Let's draw from you. Let's cast Demi on you. If you're not immune. I presume she's going to be immune to it. Oh no, she's not. She can't have that much health, I don't think. No, she's basically got no health. It's only going to heal us again. Take Quisius away, come on. Ah, now this ability can be annoying. As it's a gravity based attack. What can we use to piss her off? Don't you start using dis. Oh, you suck. Just take Quistis away, goddammit. Thank you. Now 
Now, please give us Zell. Please. It's gonna be Renoa, isn't it? God's sake. Just get out of there. We're gonna cast Scan on this cow. And an interesting note, you know you could actually cast Scan on your own party members. I know it's a bit of a silly time to show you it, but... Use a sword called a gun blade. Special skill is Renzo Kukin. Use the gun blade. Silent and a bit cold. Look at that. All stats off the roof. Absorbs all those. So we can twist him around and everything. I'm going to show you an interesting thing that I have noticed. We'll absorb it. I hope. Yeah. Now, if you cast Scan on Selfie, something very strange happens. You cannot twist her around. And you know why that is, folks? Because she's in a skirt. All you can do is twist twirl her. You can't lift her up or down or anything. How weird is that? Anyway. Come on, take Renora away. That's what we wanted. It's time to really give it to her now. Now we're going to cast haste on Zell when we can. There he is. This bitch has not got a chance. Let's rock. Always remember, gravity attacks cannot kill you. That's good, we've got our aura set up now. Ready for the oncoming battle. Damn, I missed. Now this first form of Ultimacia doesn't have that much health. That should be enough to kill her, in fact. Yep. A GF? Play, pay very close attention to this GF's name. He looks awesome. You know what his name is, folks? This is Nanaki. Now, you may remember that we named a ring, Squall's Ring, Nanaki earlier in the game. And whatever you call that ring, this GF is named it. That wasn't very powerful. What can we use against him? Come on, give us a nice spell. Just that. Oh, the lion heart! It's game over already! Game over! Bye bye, Nanaki!
unlucky. You've lost. Boom. This cannot be good. <laughs> 